you saw me walking through the machines last time, they gave me the all access pass, and now you might even see me on a machine machining because I got a license to drive. Boom! Woo! We're at Heimer, baby! What is up? This time at the facility, we're gonna actually unlock the secrets to success. In 12 months, they've exploded. They run three shifts, they do it right. They ship products all over the world. The growth is tremendous. Overall, in the whole company, they have well over 200 machines. Since I was back in Germany, I wanted to come back to this facility. What does Heimer do here that you guys can learn and implement in your shop? So let's dissect some of the crazy techniques that they have some of the processes that they put in place. I'm gonna show you how you implement them in your own shops. Boom. Oh man, look who it is. This is Andy Heimer. I know everybody knows him. He's a good friend of mine. And uh, brother, thank you so much for it. Everything, uh, Great to have you back, Tyson. And I have a little gift for you. Look at all that. It's the secret Heimer tank with all the stolen access. So one year ago, you saw the first video, Titan Pink to do it us first time. This time, we will highlight some of the success stories and secret know-how, what makes Heimer so successful. We roll hard to Peter when it comes to the pool holding, shrinking, balance, and presetting and we check out the facility. I heard you guys are up to 128 machines in this facility and like over 200 machines throughout. So in one year, you guys have like exploded. Over 220 machines, including CMM and measuring machines. So we have invested every year like 50, 20 machines. So last year, 50, 20 machines. This year, 50, 20 machines. So we are now on over 220 machines. Wow. For the next five years, we want to continue investing more than 100 new machine tools. Three shifts, six days a week, 24 hours machining, but also lights out machining. So what we have invested a lot is also in automation, digitization, and I will show you some of those new products that can run a shift without people. Actually. You guys all know Heimler because of the amazing products that they actually give everybody. All the machine shops use to take their productivity to the highest level. But if you get to the roots and the base of Heimer, they're an elite machine shop. And uh, thank you so much, man. Like, a lot of people, they don't like to bring people into their facilities, but I think it's brilliant that you want to give back, that you guys make the products that actually help people, like, buy up. Absolutely, and we're looking forward to showing you some of our highlights, and can't wait to get started. Boom, baby. Ariel, thanks for having me again. How cool is that? Look at that. It can almost disappear in my hand. Look at that. Boom. Great job. Awesome. And then you got the tool room with the doors. Remember the doors. This is really something like the heart of our manufacturing, I would say. And I wanna, I want you to check out something very new. Awesome. New, just for you guys. Our tool management software which we tie in all things together in order to make a seamless production you know we have hyper mill solid cam siemens nx the problem always is with modern cat cam programming that sometimes it takes you more time to actually program your tool than if you have one cat cam software how to bring it to the other one and what we have here with our tool management software from wind tool is we will standardize on one software we have 10,000 tools that are digitally with a digital twin in the wind tool that we can simulate right away seamlessly. So what you will see today is how you can make a digital twin in two minutes and send it off to a CAD CAM system and how we manage resetting, shrinking, balancing everything together as a digital process. No more folders, no more papers, no more searching for it. That you can go onto our vending machine scan it, take out the right tool, and it will be digitally transferred in real time to the person that is doing the assembly list. You have seen in two minutes, we have created a digital twin, everything on a database. And now Matthias is getting actually a tool list actually to assemble it.
and the job is done. Boom, so we have shown the complete workflow and at the end our presetter already got the right measuring marker to measure it automatically to make sure the tool is fine. You see here we use those uh, shrink collets, you know, these are shrink collets. Same advantage instead of using a regular ER collet, you know, you have highest runout accuracy, highest rigidity, much longer tool life and you can offset and measure it while your machine is making chips and send the data through our presetting device directly to your control so you can be much quicker. I love machines so much. Uh, I just want to I just want to see how everything's made, how it's inspected, check out the processes, you know, show you guys everything. There's a lot of people over there growing their shops, but think about it. You can just look at like the type of like chip bend somebody uses with the wheels, you know, and you can like take that in. You know, early in my career, like I, anytime I got an opportunity to go to another shop, I would go and I would actually look at like how they did their inspection, how they did their chip bends, what kind of uniform they had. I would look at the different processes, like how do you actually, you know, take raw material through an entire shop? How do you line up the machines? You know, I try to learn everything and I would like take that back to my own shop and then I would just go ahead and like implement everything. As money became available, I would just implement it. When you have a, a company like Heimer, they've been doing it for so long. They have so many cool processes in place. It is so dialed that it's like, you gotta like learn from that. You gotta look at them as the experts and see what you can actually take from them so you can implement it and grow your own company. So here we are seeing our measuring of the tool holders and the interfaces we see here, CAP to C6 for instance. So a tool holder is not just falling off of a machine, there's a very high depth of inspection also needed. Here is really also the quality lab controlling the quality within a micron accuracy to each other. Then instead of a CMM we use different kind of measuring equipment and uh, actually measuring the results in a different way. All the manual gauging really is out there in the field, in the production, they get calibrated in our quality lab in order to ensure that from the first to the four thousands of tool holder we produce per day, everything is in the great same quality, precision and accuracy within microns and uh, complies to the HIMAR quality win standard. So here we see our double 100% inspection policy. You can see my colleague here, he is checking the inside diameter of every single shrinking holder that is linked to our digital database on the screen. All safety elements are checked, one, at the operation after machining, and second, they are checked in a 4i principle at after quality. And then every individual batch is checked twice, 100% to ensure the higher quality. We have a central database, all of these tools here are RFID tag, so you have the tool life, the tolerances, all the geometric collision data on the RFID chip. We have thousands of tools here, but what should our team do, our operator do? How does it know how much tool life is on there? So we have these little identifiers here. This is the RFID reading station, you just put it in. And then we, we push the button and say code tag, reading the code tag. It reads the code tag. And here you have a digital tool sheet. You have the, the beauty is you are tracking the actual piece count. So you have 100 pieces for the new cutting tool and here you have 75 pieces left. Uh, there will be the warning of the tool life that, that he needs a new tool. That the controller will tell us he needs a new tool. And everything is managed by our tool management and software here with our presetting, shrinking, balancing machine at heart to machine very efficient and never have downtime of your machines. You go to machine shops like all over the world, what a treat this is. It's like a big old, it's like a big old playground to me. There's nowhere that I feel more at home than a machine shop. Machining literally changed my life. So this is our new Heimer tool base system where we digitize our tool room equipment that is in your shop and we will also ship you one of those beautiful babies to your shop. Wow. So you can digitize your entire tool room. You have your Heimer card, your Titan Tech card. Replace it here. Oh, look at that. So good. 
Okay. I think I need another one of these guys too. Yeah, so, click on it. Oh, we have two in the inventory, so you can take either one or two if you want to. Awesome. It says a straw number 106. You need to check. So this one's locked, and this one's yeah. open. And then here on the screen, it's showing us, take it from the left side, and here it is. Nice. Boom. I can send you more pictures of this guy. <laughs> I keep sending you pictures of my... So easy. If you have an English speaking or Spanish speaking person, you have the tag, with Stefan it will be German, with Titan it will be English, with me maybe Spanish. So you can automatically tag and you will report and then you just click the button and say withdrawal completed. So we see their remaining stock is only one. Get one of these little guys for my kids. And the immediate withdrawal, two. Remaining stock is three, one on a four right there. We'll come down. 103, no. 104, boom, look at that. Boom, Gabby and Nathaniel, two of them. It's Christmas here at Hymer. <laughs> Without this tag, so you cannot access anything. You are operating it for the first time. It was introduced to you and in a split second you understood. It's so intuitive awesome. how to use. Any company based on all products, they can basically just give um, permissions to anybody based on who they are, Easy anything to, you want. You can say, for instance, uh, the apprentices are only allowed to use regrinded cutting re tools. tools. You can yeah. say the guy in the milling department only gets the milling tool, the guy in the turning department only gets the turning tool. Yeah. If you select the cost center, you can make very easy reports. So forget about keeping track everything in your big ERP system with a lot of controlling information needed. This enables you to control your tool room and shop floor in a very intuitive way. Well, starting, what, in September, you're going to be selling it to everyone now? Globally, yes. We will awesome. sell it globally as Heimer Toolbase. Titans of CNC will be our first partner and customer oh. getting a Heimer tool base, digitizing your entire tool room with one computer system. And this is the start to digitize everything. So this will be more transparent, easy to manage. A lot of people are like scared of documentation. They're scared of like AS9100 or ISO or whatever. But documentation is so important, especially when you're actually going after certain customers. You gotta be able to have traceability uh, from the raw material, from the factory that it comes from, you know, the heat lot, all that. You gotta be able to trace that material through the entire process to the finished parts. Like customers, they don't wanna come into your shop anymore. They wanna just look at the documentation as a license to drive, and they wanna know that you have implemented it, and therefore, when they look at it, they know like, oh, these guys are legit. Because every single process is documented and they won't deviate from that process. Everything is absolutely dialed. When you look at like Heimer and you look at all the material and you look at the tooling and you look at all the things that they have put in place to perfect their manufacturing strategies, you can see that they have a wealth of knowledge and they've done it right. If you're a customer and you come to a company like this, you're like, you know what, these guys are great. They definitely know how, so let's just quote them and we're gonna give them that work. So no matter how big you are, if you're small, you can be a one-person shop. Start building your quality manual. Start digitizing everything. Start looking at your processes and documenting everything. Don't deviate from the process. Perfect it, own it, and do that. Do exactly that. Once you, once you start going in a different way, then you're screwed. It's funny, right? Stunning, beautiful. You watch the different videos, like, I think I'm getting a little bit better, but like, watch this spin around. Let's see if I can do it. And then, like, that's like small stuff for like, that's like small stuff for my team because they're all experts and stuff, but I'm a machinist, you know what I mean? 